All right, now we're going to talk about how to use the board foot scale on your carpenter square. If you look at the, the side of the carpenter square that has these numbers on it, starting right directly under the two on the body, has a 1, 4, 1, 6, 1, 8, 1, 10, 2, 2, 2, 4, 2, 6, and so on, and you follow it all the way across, this is the board foot scale, okay? Now, first off, what is a board foot? A board foot is simply a unit of measure for wood classification and for selling. Um, a lot of suppliers use the board foot indicator. Some don't, some still do. Um, this scale assumes a couple of things, okay? First off, it assumes that the board that you're trying to determine the, you know, how, what the, uh, the board feet of it um, it assumes that it's one inch thick, okay? Now, let me give you a, uh, a practice example of, uh, of how this works. The best way to do it, I think, all right? We're gonna start off with a board that is one inch thick, 10 feet long, and eight inches wide. And we need to figure out the board feet of that, all right? Now, your go-to every single time is gonna be right here at your 12. Okay, that is the that is the beginning point of trying to determine this. All right, every single time you start off at the twelve. All right. Now, when you're figuring this out, you always start off with length, and then the width. The length is always going to be in feet. The width is always going to be in inches. A little mark there. Feet, inches. Now, to figure this one out, I've got the problem written right up here. One inch thick, 10 feet long, eight inches wide. Again, start off at 12, okay? Again, this assumes that it is one inch thick, and that's where we're gonna start. We're going to go to 10 feet long, all right? Now right here, the first eight, that's eight feet long, nine feet long, and then 10 feet long, okay? The third one down. Now, we're also told that it is eight inches wide. To find the eight inches wide, we're actually going to use this edge of the scale right here, all right? Here is my eight inches, okay? That is how wide the board is. Now again, we're gonna be coming down the same three, one, two, three, just like we did over here at the 12, right there. See where it is, eight, nine, 10, right there? And then over here, one, two, three, we have six, eight. Okay? Now, something else that's a little bit crazy about this scale is it breaks everything down into twelfths. Okay? Twelfths. So for this one, the problem that we're working on right now, for a one inch thick, 10 foot long, eight inches wide, it is six and eight twelfths. That's a little bigger. All right, that is the board foot for something of this size, okay? Now obviously you're gonna be breaking down this fraction a little bit. Six and four, six and then six and two thirds, okay? That's how that works. And it'll give you a basic estimation on um, the lumber that you're trying to figure out. And because you can tell on here, again, starting off at the 12 right there, you can go all the way up to 15 feet in length, okay? Eight foot length all the way up to 15 feet in length. Now, say for example that your wood is not the one inch thick. Let's say that it is three inches thick. You're gonna do the same exact process, and then when you get to this point, you're simply gonna multiply that by three, and then that's gonna figure out, or that's gonna tell you what the board foot for that piece of material actually is.
But what if you have a board that is outside of this dimension here? What if you have a board that is 30 feet long and you need to figure out that calculation? Well, it's pretty simple. You just break that board down into smaller pieces so you can still use your scale. Okay? Now, let me show you something else. My right, guys out there, high speed. You can also figure this out on the calculator. Let's see what we get. And we'll just go with, to make it nice and simple, we'll just do it with the one inch thick board. Okay? Now, this is a project calculator. These things are really, really handy to have. And you can literally enter the stuff in and it'll do all the conversions for you. Okay? So we'll do one inch. Right there, times 10 feet, times 8 inches, and that will tell me that I have 960 cubic inches. Alright, and this will even do my uh, conversions. I'm going to hit convert right there and I don't know how well you can see that but right above the number seven it says uh, BD feet I'll convert that and this is what it figures out to point I'm sorry 6.67 okay now let's figure out what that goes into remember what we got right here two over three I'm dropping my tools everywhere. Two divided by three. Right there. Okay. Same exact thing. But on this one, I just did it with a uh, simple project calculator. Um, this one is obviously made by Craftsman, but um, there's dozens of uh, different manufacturers, and they all pretty much do the same thing. Work very, very similar. But um, you know, if you don't have one of these, but you do have one of these, which a lot of guys do. They just don't know how to actually read and use these things. But uh, hopefully this is going to help for uh, next time you need to purchase and order some wood and you have to know the board feet.